I'm going to show you guys how to scan your work as PDFs using an iPhone and an Android phone. Okay, let's start with the iPhone. You're going to use the Notes app. Start a new note, bottom right hand corner. And then that circle with the plus, click that, and that menu pops up, scan documents. The key is having the document flat and going directly above it, straight down. Now see that little frame that forms around it? Let it center and hold it steady. It will automatically snap itself. You don't have to hit the button with your thumb. And so if you don't have multiple pages, just bring the next page in, hover over it, and it'll take a picture. Try not to have anything around the edges. If you're done, there's that save button in the bottom right hand corner. This has two pages, hit that. You can see that it's saved into your notes. Hit the done uh, word in the upper right hand corner. That little square with the arrow up means export. You have to have Schoology already downloaded on your phone. When you hit the export button, find the Schoology app, says copy to Schoology. Then give it a second, it'll open up your account. It's gonna give you two options, submit to assignment, add to resources. You're gonna hit submit to assignment, select the class, select the assignment, upload, done. It's a little different with an Android phone. With an Android phone, you have to have the Google Drive app already downloaded onto your phone. Free app, everybody should have it. Now I have to, once you open it up, select the uh, folder that you want it to go into. If you don't select any, it'll just go into the My Drive folder. There's a plus button in the bottom right hand. When you select uh, that menu pops up, hit Scan. It's a little camera picture. Uh, take a, This one you actually have to push the button. So when you snap it, okay. And in the upper right hand corner, you see those three dots. You can rename it or delete the page, rotate the page, whatever you want. Right next to that, to the left, it looks like a little art palette. Click that, you want it black and white so it ends up being a PDF. To the left of that, that's the crop feature if you need to move in the edges a little bit because you didn't center it very well. Hit the check button when you're done cropping. Hit the check button again. It's gonna scan it as a PDF directly into the folder that you uh, saved it in. And that's it.